There's a lot going on in and around Omaha, and there's one great place to keep track of it all, Metro Quarterly. Today we are dialing in on a charity event like no other. Local celebs trained to dance just like the TV show. So who's dancing this year? Our guests are here to make that very announcement. Publisher Andy Hoig, right over here, joined by Omaha Ballroom founder Elizabeth Edwards. Nice Good to, to see have both you. of you. Hi, Andy. Yes. You look scared to death. She's already. Oh, she's not scared. I'm, you're not oh, scared. I'm not. Am I scared? No, it was just the look on your oh. face was funny. Oh. Yeah. You're I'm well, not she's scared. Thinking. I'm thinking. I'm she's thinking. thinking. Well, Elizabeth so Dance with the Gumball Stars, June 11th, uh, mm -hmm. is supporting mm -hmm. two nonprofits mm -hmm. this year. Mm -hmm. Yes, we're doing the Sunshine Kids and Angels Among Us, so a national and a local charity this year. That's a great twist. Mm -hmm. yeah. And it brings us to an announcement. Uh, we've got three. Can you give us three names today? Well, did, did yes. we get the drum roll ready back there in audio? Oh, yeah, I don't roll. think we did. That's happening. Okay. Okay, let's, give, let's do the three names. <laughs> All right, so our first one is the Andy Hoy. Yay! 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 Thank well, you. You've been thinking about this for a couple well, of years. Well, you know, Elizabeth has been asking me for, for many years, and I've judged this, um, judged this before. But, you know, this is the year of Andy, like I said. I turned 50 this year. The magazine celebrates 25 years, and I just wanted, I'm just looking for ways to challenge myself. Mm -hmm. So I am all, I'm all in. You're all in. I'm all in. And this is just one of the physical challenges you're doing throughout the course of uh -huh. the year. Wait, we, hold, you hold know, I know, I know, I know, but I'm asking her a question. <laughs> yeah. And so, but you went up the stairs of the tower, and you did yeah. some other stuff. You yeah. went swimming. Yeah. So this is just another aspect This of is that. just another challenge. So I'm, and I'm totally up for it. I'm so excited. I love mm -hmm. my partner, and she it's going to be great. The other two. is competing with Andy? Well, Omaha's really gotten involved. Our chief of Omaha, Todd Schmader, is dancing. The police chief. The police chief is dancing. I'm really excited There's for him. There's rumors that he's got some pretty mean moves, too. He, he's got some good moves. Have I'm you really seen excited. it? Have you he's, I'm training him. Um, yeah, he's working really hard. He, he's so excited. He reached out to us and said he really wanted to get involved with the event, and so he's he's going to be dancing this year, That's so awesome. it's exciting. And then um, uh, John Ewing, our Douglas County Treasurer, is dancing, so it's exciting. <laughs> How's he? Have he's you seen great. Him dance oh, yet? he's fun. He's working with one of our other instructors, and he's a hoot. Uh -huh. He's a hoot. His license plate has Smooth One on it. <laughs> Sorry, I just told everybody your license plate, but, well, that's okay. but if he's a treasurer and his office is there at the DMV, I imagine there he's got go. some access. Yeah. If he's getting a personalized plate, we're saving the date. June 11th is it. So when do tickets go on sale? And then. What's the best way to either reserve mm -hmm. a seat or you can get a whole table at this point if you want. Absolutely. Um, our tickets go on sale tomorrow. If you want to buy a general admission, just uh, go to RalstonArena.com or you can just reach out to Omaha Ballroom. Mm -hmm. And we're selling all of our tables this year through Omaha Ballroom and we are looking for more sponsors. Um, yeah, so it's going to be a great event. We have Bushwhackers as our after party this year. So everybody's going to go there and celebrate and ride the bowl and dance. and. Yeah. It's going to be fun. Can we ask you how much this event has grown? When you, how long has it yeah. been? How many years? This is the seventh, seventh annual year. event. Yeah, when you but did it's it, I'm thinking back to I when. I can't remember. It was, it was the second like the year. Second year. It was second year. Well, year. And I think about the venue then and yeah. now to be at Ralston Arena. Ralston I mean, Arena. you've gone from a golf club mm -hmm. to Ralston to Arena, Arena just because mm -hmm. of the number of people who, are, who want to come and be part of it, the number yeah. of people who are dancing mm -hmm. in it. But why? Why has this grown so fast? I think it just, it's a unique charity event. I mean, it really is like a show. It brings people from radio and TV and I mean, seeing the Chief of Omaha dance is huge. I mean, that's kind of cool to see him out of his element dancing. Mm -hmm. And I think that's really what brings people together. And it's not just a show you're seeing, it's a show that's raising money for kids with cancer. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's what kind of really makes it grow. Yeah. We had 3,300 tickets out last year. Wow. wow. Yeah. That is awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I'm going to be there as a judge this year. Yes. And I've told Andy I cannot be bought. Unless and it's I a said, lot of money, hey, and then I'll give you it to charity. You don't need to be bought. I'm going to be so darn good. You won't need to be bought. I, I, I'm glad that you're doing this, but you, I am you, too. you mentioned that it's your. This is your 50th year. Yeah. Your birth, but this is also 25 yeah, years for the, for, for the publication, and you've really wanted to like not just go to dinners and be be part of that side of our philanthropic I've community. Doing, I've done that, and that's but, important. Like you wanted to do things yes. this year. What are some of the other things you've been up to in this Mad 25 campaign? So our Mad 25 campaign, here is our last challenge, number four, the Sherman Steichen Memorial. Um, it's a, a Creighton University for scholarships. Um, so this was out on the 4th. This was that Saturday when it was snowing. Mm -hmm. It was so cold, but we did a 5K that day um, in memory of two gentlemen that passed away when they were in college at Creighton like 20 years ago. I got to meet their parents and it was just a wonderful experience. I made it. I did it. Um, you know, I'm just, I'm improving as I keep doing these events because they <laughs> are challenging. Um, so this is number four. And so next weekend we've got um, a couple of them coming up, which are actually in my top five. Uh -huh. Then I'll talk about those. But um, it's just, it's been fun and we're planning out the year. And it's just a way, again, to get 
physically moving and also giving back to charity. Okay, you mentioned the top five. So yep. what's on the top five list this week? So top five, on April 9th, we have the Pink Ribbon Affair for Susan G. Komen. This is their second year. Mm -hmm. um, and okay. then also on the, on the April 9th, so this is one of the 5Ks that we're going to participate, Pinwheels for Prevention, mm -hmm. Child Advocacy, and I'm sorry, I'm getting over cold, I can't talk, Advocacy Coalition. Um, and then on the 10th, we're going to be doing the Out of the Darkness Walk for the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, mm -hmm. and that's just a walk. And then 15th, the Torchlight Ball, all about Omaha, and this year it benefits the Literacy Center of the, yeah. of the Midlands, because they pick a different charity each year. And then finally, um, Omaha Conservatory of Music. They're having their grand opening gala. I love this organization, and they're moving into a new space, and it's going to be awesome. Okay, so that's the top five, and you can learn more about all of those events. Yep, on our website. Andy puts everything online because she knows it's where a lot of you are kind of like one stop for what's coming up. Um, but I want to connect back to the giveaway because, yeah. you know, what Elizabeth yes. is doing at Omaha mm -hmm. Ballroom, and a lot of people are really getting into this. They want to learn how to dance, so what are you giving away? Thanks to Elizabeth's help this we week. We are. And Elizabeth, Omaha Ballroom is also one of our 101 Things to Love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so sh she has graciously donated three group ball les ballroom dance lessons for two. Um, the class schedule's online. There, and I listed, if you go, when you register, you'll kind of see all the different styles of uh -huh. dancing. I listed, so you can, oh, like, there they are. You can mm -hmm. learn a couple of these. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want, like, definitely a country, swing, yeah. <laughs> you want to get into hip-hop, go for it. Mm -hmm. um, but they have all, and so you can choose any of those classes through the giveaway. Like, yes. you and your sweetheart can go and learn. Yes. I love that. If you're getting married, mm -hmm. could you imagine, like, oh, just yeah. to go and, like, you know, just pick learn up some steps dance. for your first dance. Yeah. Um, so the, the website to register for this giveaway is spiritofomaha.com. You have until April 13th to sign up. You do need a keyword to register, and it is dance. And then your website, Elizabeth, if our viewers want to go and check out your full mm -hmm. schedule, what is your it's site? It's omahaballroom.com. And we serve beer and wine, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they've got a, so they they got a lot of beer and wine. I love yeah, it. Yeah, that's uh, right. How much, <laughs> how much money are you hoping to raise this year? Um, well, last year we raised 105, so we want to pass that. Uh, we oh, want to sell. Yeah, we, we will. will. Definitely. Oh, we've got the greatest dollars. dollars. Well, and I love that you've added a local charity to it this yeah, year. Yeah, that really helps. So good, That's Elizabeth. Great. We'll see you on June 11th. June 11th. Tickets yes. go on sale tomorrow, and Andy, mm -hmm. we'll see you again in a couple of weeks. Yep. Thanks, Andy. Thank Thanks, you. Elizabeth. You're Thank welcome. You. Get well. All right, the buzz over.